big surprise. I heard that Ghanaians are the best in fishing in the whole Africa. In the whole Africa. Yeah, let me see. You remove it, it goes like boom. You see? Oh my god. I am Pirate Hatu. Full speed ahead. Good morning. It's a beautiful day. We're starting the day with perfume rice, the leftover of yesterday. Never let anything go to waste. With Jazzy, Speed TV. Yes. And we are about to eat. Whoa. Like yesterday. Yeah. The shot is good of our This is the entrance to the fish pot in Togo. Alright guys, we are in the breeze is much and we got this ticket for hundred 100 sefa, right? And it's valuable for 24 hours. We'll be going now to see if we're gonna see some sharks and some nice sword big fish. We're here for the fish and nothing more. I was here yesterday. By the time we got here, they already caught the shark and the other big fish, uh, the woman did not let us vlog and she was a little bit mad. I don't know what's wrong with her. She's just being, ha, ah, you know, ladies' things, you know, or, you know, African things, anyway. All right, so we are here again to see if we're going to be able to see some nice, awesome fish and show you guys uh, the miracle of the sea. Just got updates that the sharks are here. These sharks are here, right? Yeah, they said that. Oh, nice. We can't wait to see them. I actually came to show you the shark today i'm not supposed to be here today well because of you anything for you guys anything for you guys everything for you guys i just have to keep updating you guys and show you the awesome wonders of the world damn now we can see the sharks this is baby shark no big shark baby shark baby shark come on Look at these ones. Is it a shark too? Yes, a small shark. Small shark. Is it dead? Yes. Can dead. I touch it? You can touch it. Oh, first time of touching a shark, dude. This is a baby shark anyway. You see the teeth? Ah, I should put my hand. I should put my hand. I should put my hand. <laughs> There are some content I would love to show you guys here, but uh, you know, due to YouTube policy, I won't be able to show you. You guys can check it out on my Patreon. There's a lot of shark. This is my first time seeing shark, and wow, this is awesome. I've never seen one before, I've never touched one before, but today it's a different day. It's a good day to touch a real shark, a dead one, anyway. So, we were told the fins cost more than the shark itself right yeah the, yeah, the fish pot the fish pot and you can see loads of flags but no, among no. all these oh yes that's nigeria flag over there that's nigeria flag over there that's like nigeria flag only one nigeria flag here and that's it so, yeah. 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 yeah you've seen a lot of flags up here a lot of flags a lot of flags you can hardly find Nigerian flag, but finally I saw it over there. Let's go to the Nigerian boat and chill there. Yeah, sea fish, oh, sea fish. This one is beautiful. See, look at this. This is flying fish. You can see. Mama is from Oyo, Oyo State, Oyo Alafi, Ojo Pashekere. So this is what she does. She sells fish, 
and you know this, she's selling this. All flying fish. Oh, look at this. Fly. Fly. Easy. Easy. what? Pew. Pew. Okay, there are securities and they're bringing them out from that place. And it's quite cold. It's very cold. Very, very cold. It's well preserved. Yeah, some people are repairing their boats. Uh, and those things there, I mean, this thing, it's a real deep freezer. That is where they preserve their fish. And it doesn't get spoiled until they get back. Even the preserving the fish is one of the main things they do and there is someone who just brought another one so when they go out that way they know they have to preserve the fish and that's in May. Touching all the fish they are very cold because they must not get spoiled before getting home so they need something, they need a cooler, they need a freezer that's what it serves at. So that's their freezer and they keep it there just awesome man just awesome and you can see they're still bringing them out from their boat and they can be gone for weeks or days i guess maybe not weeks but days these are still part of it and they're still bringing them out from that place There are lots of fish where that one came from. This this black uh, flags remind me of pirate flags, you know. <laughs> Full speed ahead! Finally on the boat. They go buy for the country Russia and Ukraine this and that and buy food for why? And so Baba is cleaning fish. He's is a sailor, right? Baba sailor, right? I'm a, I'm a all weather. All weather. All weather. And he wants to clean this fish and then he's going to send it to his wife. Have some crew member over there roasting fish for eating oh look at that flat fish yeah that's a double color right what's the name of this fish baba uh, okay this Kaklata. Kaklata. <laughs> you know the fishermen many know the fish as their traditional language but they don't okay. know the name of english yeah i understand uh, but you enjoy cleaning fish no serious one it. serious one because no, no, no. I don't want my wife to suffer. That's yeah. why if you reach the house to where I stay, I'm not staying myself container. People will be that people they know get mine to come out. Did you call that these things? Which this, one? These flies. These flies over there. But actually I don't know their name for okay. since my root time. But what are they doing there? Oh. They just they, enjoy staying there. We here. They do everything. If and it's not harmful to you. No, 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 no. Okay. They, when the canoe, canoe stay on top of the water, they have uh, some uh, glass for the canoe inside okay. the under. So they can live inside, be there they can do. They, they also be. Big surprise. I heard that Ghanaians are the best in fishing. In the whole Africa. In the whole Africa. The whole Africa. Like this is the fact and no one to dispute it. Yeah, you see, said it as well. Aside from Ghanaians, it's Senegalese. They are very, very good in fishing. Children in Liberia. Really? Yeah. Show them how to spice wire, how to do many things with rope. But, but what's the name of this canoe you called? You called it. Those uh... canoe have many names. You see, it, it be like a company. When you, you form your company, the name that you want to give, or you make some pharmacy any name you want to give for your heart 
then you get oh, yeah. the fisherman, I understand, I fisherman understand. actually you see many flags yeah the flags on top they, they just love it understand it. Yes. See America flag. Hey, what? Yes. Why do they put different flags? They just love it. They just love it. All right. So the flags are there is because most of them just love it since when they were small, and that's why uh, they are using it. I actually thought all oh, these flags means something like they are from that country or they are fishing from that country. So it's just like. They just love it. He just told me now, the guys who put these flags here are just lovers of the flag of the country. That's why they decided to put it there. I was even thinking, yeah, I saw Nigerian flag. It might not be ni any Nigerian on that boat. So that's it. That's it. And I'm loving this. It's a good experience for me to come here to explore, to see the world in a different uh, view, different perspective. You guys keep following me. We we'll travel often. I'm gonna show you the beauty of the world. Forget about Absolutely. all the. For five days. Really? It said some people go for five days, six days, but some goes like in very early in the morning and then come back, and some go overnight. That's why they bring fresh fish, fresh fish. Yeah, I love fish. The house wasting time, not making no spot. Oh, okay. If the gear when is see, like that, when you see the fish fresh, mm -hmm. you see the gear red. That means it's still fresh. Uh -huh. Okay. Already bought everything. It's gone. Everything. Everything sold out. So uh, we're done here, man. It was an awesome experience. Like I've never seen this before, and I really had fun seeing all these. And guys, if you want to see how they clean the shark, please join my Patreon so that you can watch all the awesome content you won't be able to see on YouTube. Guys, so after after taking it from the port, this is where they bring the fish for the fishermen and for the sellers to sell them. You see? So clean, so nice, well maintained. Yeah, let me see. You remove it, it goes like boom. You see? Oh my god. You know, I've, I've seen this type of style in um, Seme. Seme, yeah. Seme. Yeah. So you know, this is how we do it. We oh, really? remove this place, we remove the, the, the top. That was like a cap. Yeah, it goes deep inside. A cone. Is it delicious? Merci. Now we got orange. Wow, this place stinks. <laughs> <laughs> Just remember that. I swear. So. Mm. I swear. I love this. Oh. After a long day watching them pieces of shark, we decided to. I drink something to cool down. Cool the tempa. Cool the tempa. This is our. Damn, you're raw. 
all right guys we're done in the fish market the fish pot i've shown you uh, the big shark how they cut it and everything and for you to watch the exclusive video where you will see how they cut the shark because of youtube rules i won't be able to put it there so please guys please guys kindly join my patreon and then be a member uh join the membership of my youtube channel so that you guys can enjoy my videos both the one i can put on youtube both the one on patreon so that you can enjoy it just use a little token to support me i love you i love you all thank you so much for watching don't forget to like subscribe share i love you all the way from togo bye